Well, of course, and Ole, you saw the game. Let's get your reaction about this game. Let's get a reaction about this game first of all. To start with, it's a, it's a massive three points. Um, I thought the first half, we, did, we weren't really at the races. Second half, it, it really came out of the blocks. I think bringing on Martinelli changed the game to start with. Mm. The first half, that, that front three was a little bit shaky. But uh, yeah, as soon as we brought on Martinelli and then those three subs around the 70 minute mark, it just changed the game for us. Mm. How about you? To be honest, I can't say any different to what he said. Those three substitutions we brought on has changed the whole game. Like Martinelli, unbelievable. And Ketan needs a little bit, of, I think, a little bit of work. I don't think he's there yet to be starting on, in the starting 11. But mm. top three points is, is amazing. Mm. Beat City at home, what else can we ask for? Of course, when that goal went in, what was your reaction? Oh, I, I lost it, honestly. I. I didn't expect it. I thought I honestly thought at one point in the game was going to finish nil nil and it was going to be a draw. But you know that's the impact Martinelli has, and we were so lucky to have him back in time. Mm. I was, you know, I wasn't really feeling optimistic as soon as I heard that Saka wasn't in the squad today. But the second Martinelli came on, mm. yeah, it filled me with confidence. I can't lie. What about you? How did you feel when the game, uh, when the goal went in? <sighs> what can I say, mate? I'm as happy as as anything, mate. We've just beaten City at home. Nothing else I could ask for. Premier League is ours now. Mm. We're having it, mate. Of course. Who was the best player today? My my player of the match is between Saliba and Rice. I think <sighs> Rice is solid, but Saliba, he just... I mean, Haaland didn't have a peep today. You saw nothing from him, and we've got Saliba to thank for that at the end of the day. Mm. How about you? Personally, the tackles and everything Rice did, I think Rice is my man of the match today. 100% Mike Rice. Mm. With this win, do you think Arsenal now is destined to win the league? Uh, it's too, it's way too early to call, but I think it, it shows. If if we can go out there and beat City, who are the, obviously the retaining champions of the Premier League, then why should we be feared of every, anyone else? We can go out there and beat any team on our best day, so I think it's all to play for. Of course, what about you? I'd happy to win the league, but it's a bit too early. We're only, what, six, seven games in, something like that? Like, it's a little bit too oh, early Arsenal. to be called. Cool. Oh, Arsenal! <laughs> Sorry. Um, a little bit too early to be calling who's winning the Premier League yet, but I'm confident now that we've beaten City. Next game is against Chelsea. Do you think it's an easy three points for Arsenal at Stamford Bridge? I don't think it's easy, but no, no, no game's an easy game in the Premier League at the end of the day. But Chelsea have shown in the last two games that they have, they have got something. They're not, they're not what everyone makes them out to be as if they're going to get relegated or something. The form hasn't been there, but they're still a difficult team to beat. And it's a London derby at the end of the day. Anything can happen, but I'm confident we can go there and get three points. Okay, what about you? Literally the exact same, mate. Like, it's not not an easy game, but we're Arsenal. What can I say, mate? Mm. We will win any game we can, mm. and we won. If you're in the dressing room with the players now, what would you say to them? I'd say it's a big performance, but not to get ahead of themselves. It, it, it's showing that we can prove we can beat these top teams. I think it's gonna it's gonna fill us with confidence as well going into those Champions League group stages. It was a massive bounce back from that Lons game as well, midweek. But they, they've shown that they have what it takes. And I think in the long term, we can definitely go all the way.